boy, the horrible best I look to my right, sir. Oh, fuck. Lady Rachel of Mass Beth to my left. I don't even want to say it because he might get offended. Chicken, and welcome to a special episode of Game of Thrones finale cover up anything you want to call it. You got a lot of angry people, but before we do get into that, what's up, everybody? What's going on? What's up, what's up? Applause, late as always. It's okay, it's been a while. What's going on, man? Ha ha ha. You kill it, you kill it. It's then. I was gonna do the fucking Avengers theme song in a second. Yeah, I got nothing to do with nothing. What up, everybody? What's going on? Let's get to uh Rachel before we do start. How was your uh day? Whoa, we got a month off due to a lot of renovations. I guess you can say that, right? It was about three weeks. Three weeks, yeah, yeah, yeah. Episode what? Two? That was the last one we covered. Episode we was two. tight. We didn't cover the Battle of yeah, Winterfell. maybe it was. Maybe it about was. About a month, yeah. Wow, I didn't feel like it. Yep. Well, it, we, we, this show is solely dedicated to the Game of Thrones fans. So there's going to definitely be a lot of spoiler alerts on this show. So if you haven't seen this season, let alone the last episode, you should probably... Not see it? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Where my shades at, blah? <laughs> The shades are gone too. Shadisha's gone. Shadisha is gone, bro. Wow. This is the first episode you've ever done without Shadisha. Since like episode. With your eyes out. Ten, right? I'm gonna get mad bitches now, bro. Okay, we got yo R.I.P. Oh, man, R.I.P. to Shadisha, man. I knew I knew who that guy was behind the glasses. It's a moment of silence. Rachel, those glasses were from the Africans. You didn't have to steal them. It was only $5. They're not real Ray-Bans, Rachel. I can't believe they really stole them. Who stole those glasses? Those glasses walked out. She got tired of your bullshit. Thank God I'm not high today. The color kind of reflected. We left the movie on you right there. I don't know. That's a good question. You, uh, they the stole my like, they stole my little wire and then they stole the headphones. We're gonna have to have the conversation with the landlord. I don't wanna do the show no way. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, well, back sorry. to what I was saying. This Thank you, Rich. Shadisha glasses. Spoiler alert. Wait, she said she's gonna get me a new pair. So they were Ray Bans, yeah, actually. They were, they were, they were definitely the real Ray, Ray Bans. <laughs> Got them so from Dubai. You don't want the Gucci ones? Oh, even better. Were they Gucci? I think they were Gucci. Fendi? Yeah, Something the, like that. They had the green, red, and Oh, no. Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Wow. So you did steal them, Rachel. Okay, they were so I got a, an eye for good stuff. <laughs> got you. Got you. Uh, guys, just if you're watching this, you want to know our opinions on Game of Thrones, we're about to give it to you in a couple minutes. If you don't, probably want to change it. But leave a like at least, man. Give us some kind of credit so we know you were watching. But let's get right into it. You want to talk about the finale or you want to talk about the episodes we didn't get to talk about? Let's start, yeah, let's start with that. So we used that, well, just like the whole season as a whole. Yeah, all right. So, all right, Rachel, what was your sort of for? What, what do you, how did you break the season? It was, it was started off good and it, and it fell flat for me. I felt, I felt it was short, it was short and it fell short in ways. I wanted a bigger ending. I wanted a bigger, better ending. I think everybody in the world wanted a bigger ending. Yeah. Definitely. A million people. And this was like my favorite show in a really long time. Like, oh my, fa- I watched this show like religiously for since it first came out. Yeah, this is the first show that I actually did homework on. And I would, yeah, I would yeah. Like look at people's theories, and I would make my own theories. I was like, this. Was I really had to study like the family tree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really I, know I, the characters. I, I, it was, and it was, it was a dud for me. It was like you know when you go to a restaurant and. Service is great, mm-hmm. and you have great salad. Then you have a wonderful appetizer. The bread is warm. The bread is warm. <laughs> then the entree comes, and you're like, Ugh, what did I order? No. And then you're like, all right, I'm just going to get a nice piece mm-hmm. of cake, or I'm going to get a nice dessert, and then they both suck. Yeah. And then your bill is like f- so much money. You're like, why did I even come here? That's how I feel about people. Mm-hmm. I started feel- off, the appetizer was good. First two episodes were solid. Three and four were really good, and then five and six were just like... I feel similar. Blah. You know what I feel? I feel like I was sitting on the toilet since 2011, and then after season eight, I feel like I just had a fart. And you know, you got to, oh, I got a <laughs> shit, and you think you got a shit, and you're just there for a minute, and then you just, and it's just like... No, I wouldn't. I don't, that's what's happening to me, bro. That was, yeah, thank that's you for the imagery. Yeah, that, was, that, that was definitely terrible. 
No, no, that's that, definitely that, that's that, how I felt. That, that was definitely terrible. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm like, flab, flabbergasted. I have no idea what to say. Um, That's how I felt. So let's talk about the, the war. You can change how I feel. The first mm-hmm. war, the war with the White Walkers. We didn't really mm-hmm. discuss that. That was the best episode of the That season. was definitely the best episode. It was dark. It was hard to see, but it was the best episode. You know, so best I was in my house and watching it, right? Mm-hmm. And my TV, even though it's a, it's a, it's a HD, it's a, it's a, but it's like a 1080p, so it's not 4K, my TV in the room is for 4K TV. So we're watching it in the living room. And I'm like, hold on, what the fuck? Why does it look like this? My, it has, my t- it has to be my TV. So I pause it. I run to the room that's brand new, 4K. It's still that crap. I jump on the app. It's still. It was like. No, no, it was shot dark. It was purposely. terrible. Purpose. So the first 35 to 40 minutes, it was like, all right, I, I, I was disappointed. I was no, I was a good. I thought it was good when like the Dothraki like went out with their shit on fire. And Yo, that, that shit. We, we was like, what the fuck was that? Remember that? That shit just went out. It just goes out. Yep, yep, like, yep, yep. <gasps> It was, I mean, was it was good, but, it, but visually I was disappointed. But then it, it, well, it turned out. it had out. to be dark. It had to be, because that was what he wanted, an endless night. And, like, they brought the night, so. It was in a blizzard? In it the was north, in, no sun. It, it, I mean, it was, it, it, was well, it was well done. It was well done. I'm just nitpicking. I, uh, when, the, when the generals walked through and you saw them. What was that, your favorite part of the whole episode? I mean, besides the obvious. We know the obvious was, nah. was Arya with the yeah, yeah, sleight yeah, of hand. Was that was the best. That was, was, that was the <gasps> I was, thought she was done she though. Was the goal. That's I fantastic. thought when he grabbed yeah. her, I was tight. You remember? I was like, no! Yeah! yeah. yeah. <laughs> and we're gonna, we're gonna get into why Brand and then Brand didn't touch. I thought Brand. I thought she was gonna grab, you know, and mm-hmm. then Brand was gonna stab. Him gonna At that moment, I really thought it was over. I'm like, he's gonna win. Oh my god, this is how it's gonna go down. Like he's gonna take it was, over. It was he's gonna get Brand. He's gonna get the memories. Then the dragon was about to fuck Jon Snow up. Yeah, like it was. They was all yeah, about to be done. And the thing is that um, if you if you look at the episode, I think I watched it like three or four times. They show the knife multiple times throughout the episode. Oh, and yeah, they yeah, show yeah. hands multiple times throughout the episode. That's the same knife that tried to kill. That that knife's been in the show for in the series for a long time since the first season. Because remember when Brand fell first fell out? Yeah, of, of the, course. Mm-hmm. But yeah. I'm saying this one, like the director. Focused on hands and the knives. If you watch it again, just pay attention to that. Mm. He's always showing the hands. He shows uh, Sam's hand. He shows Tyrion's hand. They sh- it's like almost like saying it's going to be a sleight of hand. My favorite part of the episode, which I think was, was the most gangster part, and wh- why I thought it was over, was when um, the White Walker, the dragon, dies, and he's walking, and everybody's dead, and John is chasing him. Like, oh yeah, yeah, him. and he falls off, the, and he goes up, and then and, he runs, and he, and he, and he turns around yeah. at John, and he looks at him like. You really think you got a chance? Hold on. And raises the dead. Yeah, it's you like, were waiting for that. You knew he could do that. It was like, and then he just walked away like, I'm, I'm not coming for you. So, yeah, this, you're a peon. I'm going to go get what I got to get. Yeah. That was my personal. And then everybody in the crypt came out. Uh, that was stupid. And we said it. You yeah, you guys, we, everybody was calling we that one. Like, why would you why are they going in the crypt? It's a bad idea. Uh, 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 and it was. And it wound up being a bad idea. But it was, but it was overall fantastic episode. I don't agree with you. I don't think that was the best episode of the season. You don't? I think four was the best episode of the season. Because, and I'm going to tell you why. After? That yeah, was... I think after. Because four gave you, was unexpectedly good for me. I expected four to be trash, five to be excellent, and then six was a wild card. I didn't know they were going to end the show. I don't even remember four. But four, That's how bad it what? Was four is when... He she, shot him, shot the dragon out the sky, and then they chopped that him. That was the that only was, action no, of, the whole, was, of the whole thing, no, of the whole episode. Yeah, I agree. It was kind of it's like... Not a, but it wasn't about action. It was the way it was what done. What are we going to do now? Brienne lost her virginity, right? You know, oh, yeah, you yeah. know that they had that chemistry. Uh-huh. John and, 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 and you know, one of the ha- like all the storylines came to its fruition right there in that, in that episode. Hold like, on, so out of the whole damn episode, you highlighted two things. The no, dragon I, dying I, and Brienne losing her virginity. That's really what it's all about. Oh, oh, excuse this me, is really oh, what oh, it's oh, about oh, for oh, you. Excuse me, <laughs> I, I beg your pardon. I didn't say the dragon. Rachel sorry, sorry, sorry. You yeah, no, but you co-sign. You co-sign you definitely no, co-signed no, the dragon no, part. No, but you, no, no, you like that episode because you like Cersei, and she was really making you yeah, think that okay, she was going to yeah. win. No, it's not. I just, yeah. I, I, You're like, yeah, I Cersei. think it was it was well written. It was to the point where it made you... Like, when when you saw episode three, you, you got what you wanted. Mm-hmm. You know it was going to be a war. You know a lot of people were going to die, which many people really didn't die, but you know it was, you knew what you were getting into. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Four, you didn't know what was going to happen. And four came at you. It was like... All right, it's over, right? So mm-hmm. now all the pieces come together. You know, the the um, Arya, you know, the Baratheon kid becomes, you know, Lord, and he tells her, we've married me, or whatever. Yeah, she goes, I can never be that. Brienne, like I said, lose her virginity to him. Mm-hmm. Um, um, uh, yeah, the J- dynamic, you see, like, the, 
the, you see the, Tyrion talking to, to the bald head guy, which I very saw his name is. Mm-hmm. You, every piece you saw, it, it came together. You saw the whole thing where Sansa finds out about John. He's the true king. It was, it was, it was very entertaining. That's you need to let me get into it because you want to get right into the oh, mm-hmm. where's the dragons? Where's the fight? I wanted to be into the storyline. That's what intrigued me. Oh well, yeah, no, that was definitely important parts of the, of the whole war together. thing. This whole war thing and, and and the White Walkers. That's new. If you're a Game of Thrones fanatic, it's the story that, it, that brought you in. So all these stories were coming to his conclusions. The yeah, characters, yeah. You know, like when, when Santa comes and talks to the hound. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you back up. I'm, I'm just no, listening. I can't see Rachel. Oh, sorry. When, when, when Santa talks to the hound, it's like it was everything that we wanted to happen. It was yeah, happening. No, no. And then the dragon was like, it was like the extra. There, there wasn't. It wasn't to say that it was that. It just the that girl end I had of, cut the off. The end of season, th- the end of episode three was just so. Climatic, that After episode like, three, I didn't want to see no more talk. No, I wanted fucking yeah. four, five, and six kill each other. Yeah. I, I had enough talking well, with one and two. What pissed me off about uh, uh, so four? You guys don't agree with me. I love four. I, no, I'm not to say that I didn't. We didn't love it. It's I, just think say, it was, I didn't. We didn't think it was our. It was favorite. a soap opera during it. It was a soap opera, and then you had the action very, very end to make you want to watch five. And then I Amelia Clark, she was on Jimmy Kimmel or one of those late night shows, mm-hmm. and she had said. If you liked episode three, you didn't get anything yet. We didn't see you get episode five. So I heard that, and I'm like, oh, I can't wait, because like you said, they wanted to make it an endless night, so it was going to be gloomy, so the visual things you weren't going to see. Yeah. So visually, you weren't entertained. And plus, it makes it scarier, because you imagine me in that dark fighting, the death yeah, coming out. I, I, I get it perfect, but I'm saying yeah. from a visual point of view, no. when I thought five, now they're fighting in warm weather, they're going to fight in the daytime, You now they have to show you the war. Mm-hmm. So I was really waiting for it. So literally, I was at work. I was talking to my friend. I was like, five is going to be it. Yeah. Five is going to destroy everything. And then... Well, she did destroy it. Yeah. Le- yeah. But no pun intended. But well, five was terrible. Five was well, so disappointing. Seven. It really painted her as the bad queen. But, She's just like... We're going to talk about that. We're going over episode for episode. It's another thing Once I predicted. Once we get through all the episodes, we'll, we'll give our final thoughts mm-hmm. and stuff like that. Because I have a theory about the whole damn show. And I... I Told you who I hate, and I wish he was. I wish he would have died a lot earlier. I, I regret him coming back to life. So, as a person with ADHD, no, I did not like four. It was okay. boring. Uh, um, five. Uh, I think my favorite one was three. If I got a, well, three. I think I. I, 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 I say. I don't, I don't think I'm. I don't top think three I'm, was three, five, and six, and I didn't even like. No, nah, it, it was. Well, four is definitely top three. One and two was horrible to me. One and two was just the build up. Yeah. So you expected that. Yeah, yeah, that's, I definitely expect that. I hate building. So three, up. three, right and three it. was fantastic. Three, three made you believe. Three was great. Yeah, three gonna, was like that. Was like, yeah. be fantastic. Mm-hmm. And then four, like I said, was more on the soap opera side. I guess if you're into the story, it was more the storyline. What I said. You know, I just think like trying to put all that in six episodes was where they felt like for me. Like that's where I think. But they didn't have to do. Six was there episodes. was there a reason why they rushed that? Did they have to? I don't think they had. I to think do. they was. I think it had to do with Two budget, years? the budget or something. No. I don't know if it had to do with budget. No. Or temperature. Probably, probably. I just don't think they also don't, don't have enough information yeah. like to really stretch it because they don't have a book anymore. That's what it is. There's yeah. no creative thinking anymore. Mm-hmm. So, oh, so the book ended at the book. The book ended, they haven't. The book hasn't been finished. The last yeah. book hasn't been finished. Song of Fire and Ice or yeah. whatever it is, and then they haven't. That's why at the end of the so HBO has been trying to just like they're winging it. Yeah, they're okay, winging okay, it. Okay, what, okay. With their, what, they're, what they know is like... John wasn't even brought back to life, right? Of it. They know pieces of it. Like, John wasn't even brought back to life in the book, right? I don't know. I think he is. Oh, that's not I true don't... because I think he does know... I don't know all the books 100%, so I can't quote me on what, what is and what isn't from you the show. Them? But No, but I, I like, yeah, yeah. read on I the like internet it. about the books. Mm-hmm. That's I read about the books, not... Books. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I gotcha. Yeah, what, same thing. What, it's like Cliff Notes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Cliff Notes about yeah, because those books are really long. Cliff Notes or Cliff Notes? I don't know. Cliff, Cliff, Cliff. Cliff Notes. Yeah. Okay. But um, I think that they had, you know, they had to meet with George R. R. Martin, whatever his name no, is, no, he in, order, in order to get some things of the storyline that hasn't been go? public, yeah. he hasn't written, like, what, how's it going to end, what's it going to do? So I think they've always had, like, little information. My understanding was, like, my take, I guess you'd say, is that they've always had some kind of information about it. Like guidance, right? He probably yeah, told like they knew, like, okay, this, this is going to happen, this is going to happen, this is this is who Jon Snow's mother really mm-hmm. is, and all that kind of stuff. So then they kind of had to fill in the blanks. Gotcha. And they didn't have enough to fill in the blanks, so that's why the episodes yeah, were But longer. the thing is that, and then you get better writers, then it felt like, 
I think I, I think I read that the writers um, they just signed on to do the next two Star Wars or something like that. I don't know. So uh, maybe that's why they they, they they laid an egg. They dropped the ball. I mean, whatever you want whatever you want to call it. I think they just didn't have enough material because the books aren't finished. But the thing is that what, that's why the books had, that's like, why they had to end it. But now. this is why you got to. This is where you brilliant minds have to come alike and then start coming up with better ideas. Well, they want to stay true to the book and not deviate from it. So you know they want to be able to. Oh, we're in bed style now, yeah, all of a sudden. Yeah, Jesus Christ. We're in Brooklyn. Um, <laughs> the right. Battle of Winterfell is so, going on right outside as we speak. So the, uh, the Battle of what? A King's Landing was episode five. Um, Not, uh, the it was the bells, the bells. The Bells, the bells. bells, bells right? Mm-hmm. The Battle of that King's Landing, right? Okay. I made up my own, okay. Uh, and then the last one was so the, 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 the dragon, she, she showed that she, was, she couldn't take it anymore. She lost her best friend. She, her advisor, pretty much. So it's everybody. She's all alone. She lost pretty much everyone that she had any feelings for, besides the guy from the Unsullied. Mm-hmm. Oh, Grey Worm, mm-hmm. yeah. Grey Worm yeah. was the last one. She lost everyone. John pretty much told her Dubbed he doesn't think he could be with her. Mm-hmm. Not without without saying it in so many words. And uh, I knew you were my aunt. <laughs> yeah, well, I, I, I he got away. So then she goes. They obviously ring the bells and say we surrender, Tyrion. The only people that knew about it was Tyrion. John and Jamie. Well, Jamie wasn't a part on that team. It was Tyrion, John, and Jamie was a part of that team. No, he wasn't. He was saving his his sister. So he, I'm talking about from the people that were attacking. He left to go. Wasn't it Jamie that rang the bells though? No, somebody else. No, I don't know. They didn't no, really no, show no. who did. Oh, okay, it, okay. I could have sworn it was him. The guy, I think her, her, what is the guy that made the the mountain that thing. I think he told her we lost. Please ring the bells or whatever. Okay, okay, got gotcha, you, gotcha. She did it when she did it. Jane, um, the only one she didn't ring the bells. She didn't ring it, but she got someone down below yeah, rang they, the bells they, they, they because they knew that that was the signal to do if they were going to surrender. Something like that. Uh, surrender I, the city, ring the bells. That was the that was. I the think thing they I had think that's that's a normal. That might have been something uh, the normality of Kate's landing. It seemed like the bells is what fucked that bitch up. No, 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 because she no, 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 she knew she it. looked at the red key. No, no, but she knew it because he told her. He told her if you if you hear the bells ring. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Please, that means mm-hmm. they're surrendering. He told her this. Yeah. So she knew. And John knew. And Jamie obviously knew as well. So that's why John immediately stopped. And then when she was on the... Yeah, that's okay. why she was on the dragon and she stopped. And then she just said... She was like... Surrender's not enough. And I don't think... I, I, and All right, so surrender's not enough. She Surrend- that's what I felt like she's... I, that episode was terrible. I mean, how many minutes do you have of Arya running? I know. It was like 15 minutes of just Arya running and... and it was Getting knocked down. Terrible. Bro, all I kept saying was... If Arya dies, I'm not watching the next episode. And then the Hound in the Mountain, that shitty fight. That that was horrible, too. <laughs> it was funny how Xerxes was like, oh, this shit ain't got nothing to do with me. No, Did was, you see that? <laughs> like, it was funny when the Mountain, <laughs> when the mountain, when the mountain killed his, uh, his uh, maker. When he was like, you come with me? He said, yeah. Get out of here. <laughs> Just like that, right? I was, I, was watching, I was watching that with D. And your hero doesn't watch the Game of Thrones. And I was like, yo, you know how long this guy's been on the show, bro? Like, this was his ending. Like, he didn't, he didn't get it. I was just like, that's how he goes? Yeah, like, Matt it was like... Yeah, they've been there since <laughs> yeah, they've been, yeah, they've been the So, she burns everything down. Mm-hmm. And now we get to the finale. <sighs> Where do we start? I, I was mad at her at the end of that season, episode five. I was annoyed. I think everybody was. Yeah, I was already, I I was was, already, I, I was already annoyed at her. I, mean, it was, I think all the signs was there that she was going to be a Mac Queen. Bro. Yeah, they were making They were really painting her to be that mm-hmm. way. And, uh, it was... To me, it was um, it was a little hard to watch with the kids and the women. Well, I mean, they're also trying to show you. Like, yeah, I know, but it was a little like tough to watch. And then it's like, all right, I get it. It's like, you know, it's, no. it, I, I, it was like, meh. I, I hated it. I hated the episode, and then it brought me back to. You know, and the other thing too was like, you really wanted to see like the prophecy of like Cersei going going down by the like the hands of her younger brother. This is what I'm saying. And oh, then like all oh, the ways yes. that she could have died and it's just like, oh she got crumbled by the rocks. Oh right. she oh she gets captured, right? And then when she gets captured, you know, uh, uh, Daenerys tells Tyrion, what should we do with your sister? Mm-hmm. You know? And then it's like like make it intense. Like she just the way she dies is like, don't get me wrong, she should have died with Jamie because, you know, they should die together. But I could have I would like to see him like nah. I think it would have been cool if the guy with the, with the, glo- with the gold hand. <laughs> I would, it would have been cool. Oh no, his hand grew back. Did you see that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. his hand definitely grew back. <laughs> yeah, I, I think I, I caught that. Yeah, I should have put it on two to one. Up. They, they, um, I think the guy with the boat should have killed him. With the who? Your, your, your. He should have killed him and brought his head to Cersei and see what she said. No, I didn't want him to kill him. And then Cersei's comes. Like this is a bunch of stuff. And then Cersei sees it and she goes, 
uh, and he goes to hug him and she stabs him or something like that and then really loses it. Like she did. All right, so she was this big bitch that killed everybody. Well, you know, there's a, pet- the end, there's a petition like, to change season eight. Maybe you should yeah, be the they, writer. They were saying that before the last episode that they, people were petitioning yeah, to get a new. I was out of a million signatures already. That doesn't matter. Yeah, because it's not going to happen. Gonna, you'll get a prequel. It's not. They said the prequel's already going to come out. Blood Moon, I think it's called. And I have, I I have zero interest. Then they're calling it Blood Moon. I have zero interest in watching that. Yeah, me too. Oh, it's yeah. like it's like what what is it, The Walking Dead, and then you have Fear the, of the, the Walking Dead. That's yeah, it. That no, Fear the Walking Dead. Yeah, I, I, uh, yeah, I like The Walking Dead, but I don't watch that. I I, uh, I liked it, but I, I'm, I'm I, 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 I gave up on it too. Yeah, I'm also yeah. It's, it's, it's when they killed the tiger or the lion, whatever. They, when they killed the tiger, I was done. Really? She was, nah, she I was still with them. I think once Rick left, I was tired. That season after that season, I stopped watching. He killed it. After that season, I stopped watching. The last one left is Daryl. Daryl's my dude, but he's gonna eventually. Daryl's the best character. Oh yeah. All right, all right, with that Game of Thrones. All right, so now we get to the finale. Um, thoughts? Uh, go ahead, Rachel. Um, okay. Grey Worm pissed me off <laughs> with all his justice talk. And I, Bran, really? I feel like I watched eight years of that show oh, for Bran to take the throne. Oh, Rachel. I try to warn you, Rachel. <laughs> Nobody wants to believe that my uncle was the creator of this show. I told you this. I told y'all because, <laughs> you know, two the ones are family, and I didn't want y'all to be as in shock as when he told me. He was like, you're not. Thank you. Thank you. Daenerys and Sansa somehow fight. Mm. They, they, mm. like I think fight. they're going to put Jon Snow. I think they're going to put Jon Snow on the throne. Right. No. Who do you got? I think Brand the White Walker is gonna take the throne. So Brand is gonna be. Yep. I, I'm gonna be mad if I watch the whole show to, to see that end like that. Oh, get ready! You took a wild guess and you were right. That no, no, that wasn't. It. Oh, God, Rachel. Right. Y'all want me to tell you what happens in the prequel too, or you, you, you y'all want to? We well, know what happens in the prequel. Yeah, the book's already done, so <laughs> it's not gonna be a surprise. Stories have already been that yeah, the foundation's it. been there. Yeah, so um, you can, yeah, you want to tell us? I bet you I can tell you. What? <laughs> what happens in the prequel? You read the book? <laughs> I, I definitely don't know. <laughs> I definitely don't know what happened in the prequel. I'm fucking with that. Nah, I just think, yo, all the signs was there, bro. Like, HBO always does one HBO in the finale. They always drop the ball. They they, not, not only that. That's not a good finale. But they either. always want to do something that the, that the audience is. Like, Actually, I knew it wasn't going to be Jon Snow. I knew it wasn't going to be Daenerys. Why? Because they're too obvious? Yeah. So I was like. I put two and two together, and I was like, "Who's the least like?" And a lot of people I just thought Sansa, he was the Night King. Of, I kept hearing a lot of people saying Sansa was gonna take the throne. I mean, in, tech, in I, some I was, way she did. On but YouTube, not. there was a lot of leaks that said that, that Bran was the, was the. I mean, Bran's character always has like a uh, like an important underlying like his underlying importance to. He the, was there with the dragons. When you look at this, is, when you when you watch when she's on the dragon, and she's standing and she's looking over right before she burns, there's ravens in front of her. Mm-hmm. So he saw everything that happened. So it's like put a dick. You can always see what's <laughs> happening. I know, but mm-hmm. the, 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 all right. So you know what? All right. So mm-hmm. you're disappointed. I'm disappointed. I think they had chances to fix the whole season, like when when John comes to her, mm-hmm. right? And I'm gonna give you a different scenario. A couple scenarios. When he comes to her, and obviously, spoiler alert, you guys already know, he kills her, right? He mm-hmm. comes and says, "You always be my queen," and he kisses her, he breaks her, and he kills her. That pissed me off. Just like the, uh, well, there was gunshots, right? Well, yeah, no, it definitely was. Um, it upset me because he, he could embrace her and kiss her in death. Why couldn't he embrace her and kiss her in life? And then if they would have... Because what? that's his aunt, bro. Well, and no, when you saw him do that, he was like crying. I know, but, but like he didn't... I watch my mother around you, bro. Definitely, bro. <laughs> Real talk. It's a show and it's not. Come on. What are you trying to say? What, how deep are you trying to get here, right? All right, let me, let me. I'm trying to get my point. Right? We're listening all ears. Lou. Your cousin. All right. <laughs> Watch out, Didi. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it, bro. I knew it. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Careful, mom. Uh, listen. All right, it's a show, man. For, for Christ's sake. So anyway, tell me what you were. All right, so what I was saying is this. Mm-hmm. So it could have been cheesy, and then he could have said, I love you, and then... Because she came to him when she saw him, she's like, just be with me again. And clearly she wanted him. And I think if she would have been with him, she wouldn't have been so damn crazy. 
He couldn't be because he was torn because she was crazy. He fell for a crazy uh, chick. Uh, no, she was not crazy. She yes, was scorned. She was. No, she was crazy. She was scorned. She wasn't crazy. She was scorned. The only person she ever loved was Drago. He dies. And he dies. Her I'm, not gonna den- I'm not going to deny that she wasn't scorned, but that, it, that it made her. But, cause, but that just made her so like blinded by that. She couldn't get past it. So but, but that's why she went crazy. But this is my theory. So she, he said, you burn children. Yeah, I'm just saying, I'm just saying for the end. All right, so they kiss, they embrace. Mm-hmm. They, it would have been cheesy, but now you get the king and queen. He convinces her not to be so damn crazy. And then happy so he should have just been happy wife, happy life. I'm saying he that. Now, <laughs> that, and I would have been okay with it because then is it would have ended. Your she <laughs> wasn't convinced though. Like they, you know this, this, you know this. So uh, from that point, <laughs> right? It, then she, it would have been embraced, and they could have made it cheesy, but people would have got what they wanted. Jon Snow and mm-hmm. her together. Or when he does kill her, the dragon, how the dragon reacted. So it was symbolic because the dragon gets upset and burns the throne, throne like yeah. saying this because of this throne, my mom is dead. I found it fascinating how he was like putting his nose on it, almost like when a puppy or a baby. Yeah, he loves her. Like, that was fa- I thought I thought that was well done, but then to cry he could have. That was a sad moment. Yeah, he could have burned John. He cried. He could have burned John. <laughs> he could have done. He this. wasn't gonna do that. No, I'm just saying, but if he burns John, John is. You can't burn. He can't because he knows John's also Targaryen. You, it would have been all right, my mother. He burns him. He comes out of it, or he does all that happy horse shit with the fire, and then puts his head head down like to kneel to John, like to say, okay. Now you're, you're my master. Mm-hmm. But it was like, all right, okay. And then let me take her and, and go. It's morning. It was like, what the fuck? I was terrible. Then right after that, it's like three weeks later. You mean they still haven't killed Tyrion? Her orders were him to be dead. Why was he still alive? No, I don't think she ever got to give the orders. When they said put him in prison, he betrayed her. She said, anyone who betrays me dies. The guy knew that. That's why he killed everybody in, front, in the front of the thing. He said... If you're not with us, you're against us. So he knew they had it. So all of a sudden, Tyrion gets to live. So that was, I found it to be BS. So that's 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 my my two critiques of it, and I, I, I guess well, I have a shitload of critiques of it, man. It's one of my favorite shows. I'm pissed off. I really about. need my shades. It's hard to hide my emotions. <laughs> <laughs> so obviously, what they wanted you to think, right? Well, they wanted you to assume was that Bran and Tyrion made this happen because mm-hmm. they had that conversation that no one knew about. Throughout the last episode, they're like, to look, they, throughout the last two episodes, do you find them looking at each other here and then? They're giving each other a glance, they're giving each other a glance, giving each other a glance. I think he got a taste of who Bran was and how wise he was. He's a three eyed waver. Right no, Bran sees the future. How, Bran saw the dragon going to the King's Landing. I don't know. Bran saw I mean, the dragon going to King's this Landing. Is, this is, I mean, technically, the show didn't even have to exist because Bran could have just said, hey, this is what's going to happen now. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. But, but Bran, and then Bran tells you, when when Tyrion says, you know, would you take the crown? What does he say? Why do you think I came this far? What do I came here for? I know. So he clearly knew what the outcome. And Tyrion, he was Tyrion was the only one that spoke to him. Well, I think he gets his little visions and pieces, so it's not really like he's got to put it together and then it's like okay. Well, remember he got his vision and pieces when he didn't understand what he was looking at. Yeah. You were telling me from in the beginning when he was barely getting by. When he was the third eye raven, he went to the tree and he yeah. could see everything, yeah, and barely, then he could see yeah. the whole so destruction. So you think he hasn't evolved? That he hasn't seen things. He said the walker's gonna come for me. When the walker was coming to him, he doesn't move. Like almost like he knows what's gonna happen. I, I, I know my sister's about to yeah, beat the shit out this day. Right, you know. So I, terrible. Wait for it. Terrible, wait terrible, for terrible, it. Terrible, and yeah. terrible. So and. Fuck you, Jon Snow. I hate him. He's the worst character ever in HBO history. No, he's not. He's the worst character. No, he's, ca- he's the yeah, worst never seen character Oz. in HBO <laughs> history. But he, HBO didn't write him, right? But he was terrible. Every every decision he made throughout this whole show. That, I'm talking about throughout the whole eight years, eight seasons has been terrible. He lost his his brother because of the, wanted to fight the bastard, right? He lost his his woman because he's he because he had to be. I'm white, I'm, I'm the white, whatever, the Night's Watch, so he doesn't protect the woman that he loves. I'm white, he, I'm white. Whatever, <laughs> what is it, the Night's Watch. Where's the show going? White Walker, I'm sorry. Jesus. Night's Watch, he loses it. He, 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 the dra- the, one of the dragons get lost because of him. All his decisions, if he would have just been with Danny, yeah. I don't know, if he would have been with Danny, that? right? The, the, Let me ask you a question. The Ice King or whatever. Uh, what, what, who? She's it's not one. all on him. All it's right. all right. Well, if he you telling me, all right, <laughs> you're telling me this. Hold on, I'm asking you a question. Ramsey Bolton was a horrible character. No, King no, Joffrey no, no, was a no, horrible, horrible no, no, character. No, no. When you say horrible, that means they were just evil, terrible people. I'm just saying he's horrible. I hate him. He doesn't do any practical things. He's like, 
honor. He doesn't, he doesn't, no, there's no practicality in him. And then he's always conflicted with what's, what's right and what to do. Exactly. And how to help please everybody. That's his problem. And that, that's it. And this is his problem. And Tyrion used that against him. Tyrion knew exactly what to tell him to get to kill the, 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 the queen. Exactly maybe, what to tell him. Maybe so. He said, you know, you, you've done all this for the people. It was about time Tyrion and did something smart this gonna, season. He, he's been doing, listen. I don't think that he thought that that's how it was going to go down. And I don't think that he, he knew, thought that. He no, knew no, what I mean, buttons to press to get John to do it. But I don't think he knew that, that that's how they were going to hold him hot. They were going to take him in and not let him be king. I, 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 that, but at this point, like I said, if you go with my theory that Brandon and Tyrion planned this whole shit out after that conversation, hey, if you just go with that theory, right? And I, and, I, and, and, and it's like if, I'm done if, with theories on that show. Yeah, I hate it. I'm sorry, I'm just pissed. <laughs> if I tell you this, if this happens, then this happens, this happens, and then it happens, you're gonna stop believing mm-hmm. me. So maybe Tyrion started believing him. But Jon Snow is the worst ever. And then if Jon Snow, when she said, you know, just be with me and and be my, my you know, with me, be my king or whatever, mm-hmm. those words, when before the war started, do you think she burns down uh, King's Land, Landing? And John says, yes, I'll be with you. She doesn't burn that down. Even she if she goes lose that girl. anybody on her side. She wouldn't burn that down. But that was before, like, Melisandre died and, like... Even after Melisandre died. Other if John would have been with her... Dragon died. When, when, after Melisandre died, they talked. They still got together. He, he could have told her, listen, I love you. After this, we're going to be together. No, he so you would be with your her. aunt he to save New York to City? So he could have. He didn't talk to her after that. It's not New York City. He saved the world. That's not... She was up in the cave, like, all by herself. He could have came. You know, that season episode ended when it was that's just her believe, on her. That's why I believe he really loved her. Yeah. He never loved no, her. He wanted to get some skins. You know what I'm saying? He did what he did, but he didn't love her. You don't love somebody and just, oh, you're mine, I don't love you anymore. And as foul as that sounds. No, when you start seeing a dark person, that can change your feeling. You're thinking about it from now. You're talking about that. They were all doing crazy shit. They were all doing crazy shit, but not in Winterfell. Incense did not rock in Winterfell. Yeah, they yeah, clearly yeah. Yeah, that's a, he said right. that. He is right. Which means Jon Snow thinks like me. You Lannister. So then see, why did he kiss her? I at see the why end? Xerxes is your so favorite So why did he character? kiss her before he stabbed her? Because he had to stab her. No, he kissed her because he loved her. He was in love he with her. He did love He was conflicted. Right? Listen, there's such thing as confliction. And there's such thing as ambivalence. Like, you can love somebody, but like still hate things about them. And oh, Trust me, I know. <laughs> and you're right. Louis, you are right. Tommy, can you say that again? You I are right. Love you being are right. right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You are right in the sense that the Targaryens are used to being, they're all incestuous and all with each other. That's why they all have that white hair. Mm-hmm. He's not used to that because that, that, you're John right. doesn't rock in Winterfell. should have gave her the, the penis. <laughs> yeah. And everything would have lived happily ever after. I just think you would have enjoyed that. Uh. As a typical man. What well, typical man? He would have enjoyed that. Rachel, please don't, don't involve all men in this, please. Oh, are we going to start this man? Well, I I you would think you're a typical man. I was going to wait until the next episode. Yeah, I'm kind of rare, man. <laughs> I, I was going to wait. Well, listen. Um, How do you know who's the one that burned down? Who's the one that burned everything down? Was that um, a man or a woman? First of all, that's irrelevant. Is that a man? It's irrelevant. Good point. Good point. You deny the girl the D, and she'll burn the whole thing. Because that's it wasn't about true. the D's. Wasn't wasn't what she wanted. So I, therefore, I, I, couldn't I, make her happy. But a woman scorned. It, it showed that nothing's worse than a woman scorned. Yeah, no, I'm not. So I'm gonna burn that. everything. But kids, I'm talking about women, saying the D is gonna make her happy. Nah, I'm nah, not nah sure. I definitely I think know. John Snow's D would have made her happy. I kind of gotta agree with just a little bit with that because it was once she once he was like nah. I can't do it. She was like, well, what, what is it that she said? She, she said, sir, well, 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 blood it is or some shit yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, she, fear it is. Fear it is. There you shit. go. Fear it is. Mm-hmm. He could have shut that whole thing down. And I'm not saying it's because she was. Shouts to you, John She Snow. was yearning for love. And she wanted love. And everybody that loved her died. Drago loved her. Yeah, but that's a fucking Drago. <laughs> but the guy, even the guy, the old man that was mad in love with her that dies. That she, that's another thing. So joyous. What the fuck did he say to her? What did she say to him? He, she whispered, he, he whispered something in her ear. I have no idea what you're when, talking about. When they're, when they're, the last conversation they have, he whispers something in her ear about Tyrion and about Sansa. That's when she goes to go talk to Sansa. Um, That's a mm. conversation she had. I, I didn't catch that. Twit. I have no idea what you're talking about. Yeah. The, the, when they, when they, they're talking, and then he whispers something in her ear, and then she goes and has a conversation with Sansa. Then when he dies, she whispers something in his ear, and it just says whispering. You don't know what the fuck they said to each other. Who are you? Who's the old guy you're talking to? Daenerys, and then the one that used to protect Daenerys that had the rocks on himself. They turned to the rock, the stone. Sir guy. Joris. Yes. I don't know. Maybe it was meant to be. He whispers. died in the in the fight. I know that, but I'm saying, 
when he was on the floor dying and they're talking, she lays down, he whispers, she, I'm sorry, when she, he's dead, he's knocked out, he's dead. She whispers something to him and then it says whispering. I, I put the, the things on. When they were talking and he was giving advice. He did great advice, this last season. And he was giving advice, right? <laughs> <laughs> I was on point, I was watching. Hey, whatever. Listen, I think I just, you pick up on some really, really like, I watch, intricate, I, 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 I don't know, I details. I think he's so you know we're uh, I think we should wrap this up. We're definitely uh, wrap it up. You took the whole segment. We gotta talk about a few more things. Uh game of Jack N. <laughs> Seems I was like really uh, sorry, all right. Go ahead. Uh real quick, let's get to the true little bit of thing. What was uh your f- favorite episode of the whole thing? Real quick, please. Let's not spend another okay, 30 I know, minutes. I know, I know, I know, I know. You know? Mm-hmm. You're all right. Okay, you go. Sounds the six the dogs on Ramsey Bolton. I'm, I'm close to that because I was going to say the, um, battle the Battle of the Bastards, of the bastards bro. Oh, when Jon Snow was standing there, bro, I was like, oh, it's over for him this time. And then the, the, the yeah, army came right yeah, behind him. That, that was definitely like that was, that was the, the most that climatic. Was, that was probably the best episode. The best episode that was Bees. Yeah. That was I, I, I think okay. the okay. last... They took back the... Yeah, but I think the last 20, 25 minutes of episode three this year might be the best time time in, in the whole series. That, mm. that 20 minutes. I know when those White Walkers, the generals came walking through, yeah. and I was like... <gasps> it was like, that was intense. Yeah. Was really Even when the White scary. Walkers fought the Wildlings and, and at the, at the oh, yeah, that the, was dope. Yeah, too. that was, that was good cool one, too. yeah. Uh, all right, what else? Battle of Blackwater. Uh, Rachel, if you had to pick five people out of Game of Thrones for your army, mm. who would they be? I don't know, names. Um, Arya Stark. That's one of mine. Um, Brienne of Tarth. Walter Mercado. <laughs> we'll show you that. One, two. Um, you don't have to be five. You don't have to be five. We live with three. 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 Oh, um, the dragon's a cheat code. That's what I was going to do. The three dragons. <laughs> That's what I said. That's five. Not there. Five people. You said people. <laughs> I, I would say, I would say, because warrior wise, I would say Grey Worm. Um, I would say one of the. Grey Worm, probably the uh, the, the, the redhead guy. Because I, I found him to be fascinating. The wildling? Yeah, I liked him. Drago? No, Aquaman? He's the one that, that drinks the, the giant's breast milk. He's the one with the funny stuff. Yeah, I'm right? forgetting his name. I like him. And uh, and probably Arya, because those are the three characters I would deal with. If I'm dealing with just one. Um, I definitely wouldn't pick Jon Snow. I'll tell you that much. I hate him. And Sansa. But he's a pretty good fighter because he hasn't. Mm-hmm. I, I like, uh, and Sansa's, I, I think Sansa, she's just gorgeous. Like, she but she's not a fighter. I got Jon Snow, Tyrion season one through five, because I don't know what happened to him after that, because he's a mastermind. Well, you, you, yeah. said, you, you said your team or your soldiers? My team, my team, my team, oh, bro, my team, okay. my team. So, team, I'm looking at just pick warriors. Team, you want to look at people that got brains and stuff like that. You want to have. I would say. I, would say, I said Brienne because she beat the hound. I like Littlefinger. She showed that. No! Oh, Littlefinger, wait, he is kind of, he was kind of, he was kind of. He was conniving until they caught him. He, look how much that I didn't even think of that. Yeah, yeah. Littlefinger was, was fantastic. All right, all right. Um, Did you take the mountain? No, he wasn't. Was, ah, I'll take the hound. Taiwan was very, was, was very good, too. Taiwan Lannister. Taiwan. Taiwan Lannister. Tywin. He was very good, too. That's the father. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was very. You know, I'm a Lannister. That's his. No, no, you are. This is Team Lannister over here, man. By the way, by the way. I, I'm gonna put the picture here. When when Tyrion went and saw his sister and his brother dead together, why their head wasn't crushed? I'm just saying. Why what? Why why their heads weren't crushed? Jamie had the I'm just saying, golden hand I'm on just the saying, Why the head was not smashed? Oh, yeah. They're like they wanted to show they're the fully face preserved. And see it. Yeah, their you know, it's, that's just Hollywood. <laughs> yeah, that was Hollywood. Son. That was Hollywood. <laughs> what else, Mister? If you was king, what would your name be? So, for instance, Bron the Broken. <laughs> What will you be? Brand the broken. Brand, I've been calling him Bron for. Yeah, t- <laughs> <it's called> Bron <laughs> the <laughs> Hold on, who the hell's hell that guy you claim is going to be the king? Sir Josh. <laughs> the Mole. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say that. <laughs> <laughs> Sir Josh, the Mole of Brooklyn. <laughs> I, I don't have a name. Oh, yeah, no, 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 Rachel, no, come no, on, come no, on. No, I'll no, make one for you. I was going to blow up her nickname, but I'm not going to say it. Yeah, no, it's okay. <laughs> no, 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 no. I got it. Lady Rachel of... Lady Rachel Chicken Tooth <laughs> from the house of Maspin. <laughs> it's inside joke. Uh, uh, that's not even funny. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what are you going to be? Uh, I'm really talking about it. 
<laughs> Sir Lewis, the frenulum slayer of House of Arroyo. <laughs> Watch episode, I don't remember. Sir Lewis, one brow. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta edit that out. Huh? <laughs> that was good, that was good, that was good. Um, what do you think? Should they, um, after the, after the, um. Can the movie be made after this? That's where I was going. To, 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 to see what you asked to be for, I don't know. I'm saying, would, would it be. Would you want to watch it? Uh, yeah, I would watch that. You watch? So, I'd watch a movie. If they had a movie, uh, yeah, I'd watch it. Would you? I'd probably watch. I'd probably talk and shit. No, 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 I'm not supporting them. And I come like, oh god, let's go watch it. I would only watch it if Jon Snow was dead. <laughs> He's That's it. That's it. Go ahead. So you would still hate him if he became the king? He sat on the throne. Yeah, definitely. No, I would. Uh, that's what I'm saying. If it would have went that route. I think with the writing wise, if it went and he would be like, yeah, he was worth all of the decisions he's made because he got no, 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 no. But it would have been at least, it would have been worth it. Like he ended up right back to where he was. No, and that wasn't his decision though. I mean, he didn't want to be king no matter what, so he was gonna walk away from it. So, actually, I'm I'm, I'm talking mess, but I I predicted that. So he's gonna go back north. So him and Arya are gonna leave no matter what. Arya's going no, uh, she's going west. west. Of she's out. I, I, I didn't even know there was she's another going world. To, yeah. She's going to Easteros. Like, it's, that, seriously, yeah. I'm, 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 I didn't even know there was another. <laughs> I don't want to sound stupid, but I didn't even know there was another world. I thought Westeros was like Earth. No, 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 they have. East, they already have mm -hmm. East of Westeros. That's no. where all the other. That's where Daenerys started. No, but I didn't. I didn't. Again, I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. So this, that's why I, I was. When she was uh, like, when she was like, I'm going to find North other places. And, I was like, okay, I don't, I don't know what... The all those areas that they were in. The only thing I knew was Westeros and then north of the wall was where the wild things were from. Where do you think Daenerys was that whole time? Where it was like deserty and the... the that, I was, Dothraki that, came from and the yeah, Spencer okay, yeah, came from. Yeah, I got from. you. Okay, it's... Uh, yeah. They had it come <laughs> on the water somewhere. Oh, I remember. <laughs> I, I guess that, 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 I wasn't as into the show then as I am now. Mm. So. So now you're really picking up those details. Now I'm like, really? The big plot lines you were missing. They, you know, they, they made us wait for two years, so the anticipation was like, I'm not missing a minute of it. It's happened a long time ago. Where do you think um, Arya learned all the house in black and white? She went and became no one? But ain't okay, she going right, like past right, all right, right, sorry, She says okay, she's going with a map is not a... Have you ever looked at a map of Westeros and the whole no, game, I have not. game of Thrones? Look at Google. The only map I look at is the map, the map that they put when they are fighting. TV. And they put the map <laughs> on there. And then... <laughs> 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 the beginning when they show the map. That's about it. All right, if you could if you could change the ending in any way, how would you do it? If I could change... How would your ending go? I would... Still have John murder Daenerys, and I would have him just take the throne because he's the rightful king. Now, if rightful she didn't burn, if she didn't do the burning thing, would you still want John to be king? If she didn't massacre, him, so yeah, no, I wanted John to. I wanted John to. Yeah. Be I wanted Daenerys to burn everybody. You know, already know what I wanted. For Cersei, to, yeah, yeah. For, for Cersei to, to make kids with his sister no, and they have a whole Lannister no, kingdom she, of. When she said, let's kill Jamie, I, I wanted her to kill Jamie. <laughs> and I wanted it to be, I wanted it to start off like how we started. I wanted it to just recreate itself. Where she was having another king with her brother's kid and it all started from square one. No. I would have I loved to see no. Game of Thrones in Spanish though. Like, <laughs> no puedo. Tu eres mi tía. <laughs> Tú eres mi titi. ¿Cómo se hace eso? Sobrino! The lighting would have been too bright and it would have been too much makeup and a lot of plastic surgery. Wow. The women <laughs> with the duck lips. Ay, que tú haces, yo. It should have been Selena in the beginning of the thing. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right. And then in between, in between the show, the commercials. <laughs> For Univision. There's no commercials on it. It would have been on the show. You ruined it. It would have been on the show. You're not going to watch it on HBO Spanish, HBO Latino. This is the joke. Pow. You kill it. Let's right. <laughs> wrap it up. Guess what? I do the editing. So that won't be on there. Edit that up. Well, lovely, lovely, lovely. Guys, this is our special edition of the 2 to 1 show. This is going to be the Game of Thrones. Oh, wait, wait. We did say spoiler alert, but this is coming out when? Today. By tomorrow. It'll be on tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yeah. So tomorrow's what? Tuesday? Man, if you haven't watched this from Tuesday already, you deserve to get a spoils for you. I just want to let you know. Stop <laughs> using Fire Stick. Get HBO going out. <laughs> All right. With that being said. With that being said, let's do it. We're leaving, we're leaving, we're leaving.
I got complejo now, bro. You're gonna like make me take this out when I get home and destroy all my eyebrows. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching the two to one show. I'm your boy Best I Lou. To my right, Rachel. To my left, Jack N. Make sure y'all catch us at two two one underscore show. Make sure you get HBO going now. Get off the fire stick. It's illegal. I'm a Brooklyn nigga in the house. Clouds that look like Vinnie Styles. Mama told me how to treat ladies. I can make Penny proud. I'm a Brooklyn nigga in the house. I'm a Brooklyn.